Hi, welcome back. We are uh, talking about uh, Oracle eBusiness Suite architecture. So far, we have seen the evolution on how from uh, a mainframe application, uh, the applications have uh, moved, uh, moved to a client server architecture and from there they have evolved into a three-tier logical architecture. So in a three-tier architecture, uh, we have a database server where all the data is being managed and uh, all the application and the business logic now has moved from the client it has moved to a middle uh, uh, server or an application uh, server so all the application logic uh, is now run in the application tier and the client tier uh, basically has a lightweight uh, browser which accesses the application uh, so in this case the client has now become a lightweight which accesses the application running on the application tier through a browser and the application tier is where uh, which runs all the business logic and based on the needs it uh, accesses the database server so here is the three-tier logical architecture where you have the the client uh, where the users are accessing the client over the internet and then you have the application server where you have all the technology stack being uh, installed uh, and that's where the business logic of the application resides and then of course you have the database server where the actual data resides uh, along with the database software so let's look at the, the architecture uh, in detail a bit so uh, the multi-tiered architecture uh, is designed for distributed computing and one of the things that we have to remember is in a three-tiered architecture the whenever we talk about the three tiers we have they are all logical tiers not physical nodes or machines now uh, from an implementation standpoint, you can have multiple nodes or you can have uh, a three-tier architecture. You can uh, uh, implement it all, all on one box, on a one big box, or you can use three different uh, boxes or you can use two different servers. Uh, so the key um, idea is the three-tier architecture is the logical groupings and not really the physical machines or nodes. And of course, you have in the three tiers, you have the desktop uh, or the client tier, then you have the application tier and uh, the database uh, tier. And, and basically in this, what um, what a three-tier architecture does is it uh, shifts the software administration from the desktop towards the middle tier or the application tier. So in this case, uh, let's say if you have 100 or 200 users, depending on the number of users and the load, you might have a, uh, two or three servers that are acting as the application tier, and you might have only one or two database servers. Now, uh, these two or three application servers that are being used uh, might be um, uh, might, might be uh, So the, the three application uh, servers would be uh, processing the requests from the uh, uh, from those 100 or 200 users. So, uh, but again, let's say if you, in a situation if there are only a few users, then um, uh, you might have only one uh, server that uh, hosts both the application tier as well as the database tier. And of course, uh, by uh, moving the maintenance to a application tier, you're centralizing the maintenance and support and it eliminates uh, installation of uh, uh, the, the software on each desktop. Right. So the client tier, uh, primarily within Oracle applications, you'd uh, we'd be um, using a, a browser and within the browser, Oracle also has something called JInitiator that enables 
uh, to access the core uh, core of the applications developed in Oracle Forms. So Oracle has developed something called JInitiator, uh, which uh, gets downloaded the first time uh, someone accesses the application. Uh, and the JInitiator is nothing but a Java applet that uh, uh, runs on the desktop and uh, projects um, the Oracle Forms screens from the application tier. So it kind of um, uh, making using the JInitiator Oracle has enabled was unable to uh, display the forms over the web. And in the application tier is where you have all the uh, the forms and the report server and the discoverer and uh, and all the other uh, technology uh, mi uh, middle tiers uh, software that is required for um, the application. And uh, the database server uh, or the database tier, of course, uh, runs the, the database software. In the next video, uh, we'll be going over the application uh, technology layer.